It's Russ Gould from Inspire 2017. I have a special guest with me who's come a pretty far away today. So I'd like to introduce Nevra Biekla um, from Turkcell. Uh, so where, where are you from? Turkey. Turkey. We are in Turkey, Istanbul. <laughs> so you have come a long way then? Yes, it has been about 24 hours flight. Wow. <laughs> That's a long way. That's a lot of travel, a lot of airplane time. <laughs> so is this your first Inspire? Yes, this is our first uh, in Inspire. And, and what brings you to Inspire? Uh, we came here uh, for t to announce our project with biometric signature. We use Kofax SignDoc uh, and uh, we came to tell everyone that our project is in production and uh, share our experience. Well, very good. And let's, let's talk a little bit about that, because I, I know um, Turkcell has probably got about 50 million subscribers or more. Mm -hmm. um, what were some of the things you were looking at in considering you know, on this digital transformation journey and using electronic signatures? Mm -hmm. uh, Turkcell is uh, a leader operator in Turkey and its region. Uh, so we are in a digital transformation. Uh, we want to increase our customer engagement. Mm -hmm. Uh, so uh, we want to use innovations in technology uh, to develop our processes for our customers for a safe and secure way. Uh, we want them to select Turkcell, to prefer Turkcell uh, with these operations. That's why we, uh, we want to use biometric signature uh, to create a seamless journey, to create a, a hmm. remarkable journey for our customers. Hmm. And in terms of your customers, um, I suppose even your customers and your dealers, probably there were some, some benefits here. So what's some of the feedback you've gotten from your customers mm -hmm. and, and your dealers? And how has that benefited uh, Turkcell? Exactly. Uh, exactly. We, before beginning this um, project, we make some surveys to our customers and dealers to understand their intent. Mm -hmm. uh, w with the launch of the project, we see that they are all pleased because uh, we increase time to service for our customers. Mm -hmm. uh, we increase the uh, evidence uh, for the contracts. That means uh, a safety for our customers. And also for the operations for our dealers, they are pleased because we increase uh, all the documents operations that is going on mm -hmm. in the dealers. Uh, so we changed our mind the way of de doing things in our dealers. And this pleased uh, all the dealers and also the customers. Hmm. So in terms of benefits, companies always look at return on investment, which I'll, I'll get to <laughs> in a second. But it, it sounds like in terms of the dealers as well as the customers that um, this may have given you some competitive advantages? Uh, yes, with this uh, solution, uh, we will be using uh, in our uh, 1,100 dealers shops. Uh, and uh, we will stop doing all the paper processes mm -hmm. in those shops. Uh, that means uh, 22 million documents in a year that we create in a hard copy format mm -hmm. is not, crea it's not okay. created at the moment. So, uh, which means 147 uh, million uh, paper per year. Uh, so there's a lot of cost for dealers and also time for our dealers and also for customers. So we will gain for all those. Wow, it's impressive. Those numbers are, <laughs> are very impressive. So, and in terms of the return on investment for Turkcell, have you had a chance to, I know you're just getting into production and it's live and everything, um, had a chance to kind of look at the return on investment uh, in terms of the payback and what kinds of, you know, savings you've achieved? It sounds like there's probably some from uh, just the pure paper of course, side of we things, We are right? expecting OPEX savings uh, and also operational savings. Uh, more of that, uh, we save for the whole uh, documents that we create. It is all, they are all digitalized. So compliance is obviously a, a big issue for a lot of organizations and particularly for Turkcell, I'm, uh, I'm sure. So could you talk a little bit about um, you know, in terms of compliance and your digital transformation, you know, what this means from a compliance perspective. And then I think also in terms of electronic signatures, obviously that's the, you know, frontline engagement with your customers, but how your Turkcell's digital transformation is maybe making an impact in other parts of the organization. Uh -huh. uh, with the idea of the digital transformation, they begin to use tablets and uh, we create the contract in the 
uh, CRM application, mm -hmm. and we make our customer uh, take uh, give the biometric signature on the uh, tablet. And we use bi uh, biometric signature and capture the documents for the customer. And whenever a customer is created in the system, we also generate the whole uh, documents and contracts in the digital archive. Mm -hmm. That means uh, this support uh, our compliance rules because uh, in Turkey uh, we are we as a telecom operator uh, uh, should uh, take the whole uh, customer documents and the contracts with them whenever a, mm -hmm. a customer is created. So with this project, uh, we create the whole things that we have to immediately within the system within the process. Uh, so uh, we are uh, confident that we support the whole uh, compliance rules. Very good. Impressive. <laughs> Sounds like an impressive project. I bet you're pretty proud. Thank you me. and the team, right? <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Well, I wanted to thank you very much for your time. Thank you for stopping by. Really appreciate your time. Thank um, you very much. Thank you very much. Yeah. And that concludes another uh, session here at uh, Inspire 2017.